Hi, I'm Nate Moore. This is Excel Video 73. I've taken the graph, this chart that we played with last time and have added a couple things. Ouch, there for a low month. A note over here saying there's a new United Healthcare contract in June, and that's why this is up in June or whatever. And this picture over here that could easily be a logo or something like that. I want to show you how to kind of fancy up uh, your charts with a couple of these uh, add in kind of things. All three of these things are in this insert menu. And let me show you how I did it. I'm in the layout tab of chart tools. So I'm in the chart and that's how I get these menus here. And from layout, I'm going to do insert picture. Um, I'm just going to take a sample one out of here and you'll see this sunset is what I did. And what it wants to do is make it the whole thing. So I'm going to go down and just change the size and shrink it up some and then we can shrink it even more if you want. And you can see that's, I'll make it even smaller. That's how I got a picture that looks like this. And you, I mean, I'm not sure you need a picture there, but you could easily put a logo there or um, something else that either branding or your uh, clinic or a department or something like that. It'd be easy to put a picture and embed it in your chart if you like. Um, let's get out of the picture back to the graph. So I can go back to the layout menu and insert. Insert shapes. There's a whole bunch of shapes in here, so much so they don't even fit on my screen. But from uh, the list of shapes, if you scroll all the way down, there's a call out down here. And I just picked this call out and we'll drag it and make it look something close to what we did. I'm going to right click and edit text. You can put ouch there. And you can put it kind of wherever you want. And that's an easy way to put not just a, a little call out balloon kind of thing, but wrong tab, layout, any of these, a whole bunch of different shapes. There's a whole slew. You can do arrows and uh, flow charts, all kinds of things you can do there. Text box is what I did to this, this thing in the bottom, this United Healthcare thing. And so see how my cursor has changed. Where should we put it? Let's just put it down here. And I'll just put. UHC to make this a little bit smaller so it'll fit in there. Now I've got UHC there. Then what I did is when you right click and uh, whoops, I got to right click on this UHC box. Then I get format shape. And what I did, there's a whole bunch of things that we're, we'll spend some time on down the road about line color and style and shadow and 3D and all that. I just did a gradient fill and I picked from here this one that they call ocean and that looked pretty close to me. You can see, um, watch what happens to the gradient fill. I can play with this a little bit. Can you see UHC, the, the gradient kind of move down in here? We'll click close there. And then this C, these, uh, this square here will allow me to size it. This green circle will let me turn it this way or that way. And then once it's close, we can maybe shrink it up a little bit and drag it wherever we want to go. Turn it that way or that way or whatever. Three things you can do from this layout and insert menu that can kind of add a, a variety of things. They don't have to be what I've done. It's easy to do a logo, easy to do a call out or uh, any kind of formatting kind of things to make your data stand out in Excel 2007 charts. Hope that was helpful for you. Thanks for watching.